Hello everyone. Good evening. Welcome to the Udu for Beginners. Today let's discuss about super important for managing your finance which is reconciliation is Udu. Don't worry. It is not as complicated as it sounds. Let me break it down for simple terms. Let's consider with one example that you are managing your personal bank account. At the end of month what we are doing? We are verifying that bank statement to make sure that each transaction is match with what you have received and what you have paid. Now this is with our business also. Reconciliation in Udu means that matching of that bank statements with the transactions in Udu. Now here one part is the bank statement and another part is the transactions in Udu. How we can match that? For that, first of all, that bank transactions will be in our Udu system. For that, we have three methods that we can do it manually, we can import it and we can do it by syncing the bank. But as of now, we are considering it, we will do those statement entry as manual. Now that part will be done and at the second part, that Udu bank transactions. For that, we are just going to create some invoice, doing the payment against them and etc. So without wasting the time, let's jump to our database. Before do any steps, we have to check one configuration which is very important. For that, let me go to that accounting. In that, let's check the journal. We are doing the payment from the bank. This is most important thing that the account must be outstanding payment. Is this will be your current asset and you have to make this boolean true. This first part is done. Now I am again going to our accounting. Now bank is there and I am doing the manual entry for that bank transactions. For that transactions. Now we are doing that. Payment. from um, Mr. Jesse okay, if that partner is of course that dress dress T let me make it more specific okay now this is the thing now we are received the payment of that 15,000. Okay, now this is same. Now this entry will be in positive because we are receiving the payment from that customer side. Now let me make it one more entry, which is payment to Jess. We are selecting that partner, which is Jess. Okay. Now this we are going to submit so it must be it will be negative. Now these two things are done and third entry I am doing for that bank fees. Of course it will be negative so let me make it as a negative $30. So this first part is done that bank statement just we have received one payment from the customer we are doing the payment to our vendor and the bank fees is there. Now this entry must be matched with the Udu transactions for that we are doing the transactions in Udu. So for that I am creating one invoice. Let me make it that customer is Jazz. Okay. Now we are doing. So for that. And let me add something this. And the payment will be the 15,000. everything is done and just let me make it as a confirm now invoice is created and we are doing the payment for that now create a payment here we can see that it is in payment okay now we are doing the same entry for the vendors so for creating a one bill which is vendor is yes like i'm just adding any tasting or whatever we can select and that price is the 500 let me remove this taxes. Okay, now let me add the bill date and I'm just gonna confirm it. Okay, I'm doing the payment 
and create the payment. So here it you can see that in payment. Now two transaction in Udo, one for invoice and one for our bill. Now let me go through our accounting dashboard and here we can see that saving to reconcile. If we can see that this is the payment from Jess, payment to Jess and three are over here. Now it's time to match the bank statement with the Udo transactions. So first thing is that so here just I'm selecting this and here you can see that for this we are just going to match with this and just validate. So now let's check that invoice. I'm just going to duplicate and let's check the invoice status. And here you can see that it's paid. So reconciliation is done. Now let's do for our bank, our vendor bill. Here you can see that it is match. We are just going to validate and it's done. Now reconciliation is done. Now this is very important. This is the entry in the bank statement. Currently you are not finding any transactions related with this bank fees in Udo. Okay, so what we can do in this case? In this case, we have a options for creating a model and match with that. So here you can see that. So I'm creating a one model for that. Okay, and I'm just giving the name bank fees. This is the thing that we are creating the reconciliation model. For that, we have a separate video for that. Now just removing this and I'm selecting any account for that bank fees and save. So now let's again jump to that. Let me go to that. Now this is the thing. Here you can see that bank fees. Now this is the account and validate and boom. Now that entry is again reconciled with that the model and that model link with that account. Now this is the just basic video. We can start the accounting by understanding the basic terms. You can try from that side and if you have any queries, you can make and comment. Thank you guys.